everybody and welcome to the sixth year anniversary to the AK Border 22 gaming channel. This video is the classic anniversary layout. If you guys have seen these videos before, you know how it goes. I break down what happened over the year for me and for the channel and I uh, thank everybody involved and we go over the subscriber counts and all that. So nothing has changed. We're doing that, doing the same format for year six. So this year we had some changes. Uh, Rip the prestige, anybody remember? Uh, rip the controller so we play on a new uh, scuff controller the instinct pro and um, I am moved this year I moved from the first house that I ever bought into this house and I know you guys haven't seen this house or this room uh, I won't show the house but I'll show I'll show this room uh, office update video coming soon I don't know when but it's coming uh, so we got the new controller we're in a new house and a new stream room. This year I accomplished one of the items on my bucket list. And that that item that I checked off is I went to an Avenged Sevenfold concert. I went down to Salt Lake City with Will and Rory, and we watched Event Sevenfold play at Salt Lake City, the Usana Amphitheater, and they had Falling in Reverse open. Best days of my life was awesome. It was a great time. So that happened this year. And there's videos on the channel of that. If you want to see any clips of the concert, it's there. You can look on the playlist uh, on the channel. Uh, and then I also, when we when we got back from the concert, uh, right after that, I started to work on this setup that, again, you guys haven't seen. I upgraded my entire stream setup. So some big stuff. Quick recap. New controller. New house. Bucket list item of Edge 7 full concert, and then upgrading my whole setup for where I stream and play and make videos and all of that. So, pretty big year as far as those things go. And then, I guess now I'll just do the, the sub growth recap count thing. So, I always start from year zero to where we are. So, from year zero to the end of year one, we uh, earned 67 subscribers. From year one to year two, it was 204. From year two to year three, uh, that was 435. From year three to year four, it's 555. From year four to year five, it's 880. And now here we are from year five, wrapping it up, heading into year six. We did it. We hit the thousand mark. We did 1,069 as of the time of this recording. So that was pretty hype. Uh, I wondered if I was going to give up before I got to a thousand, but I did not. And we're still here. So that was a pretty big moment. We hit a thousand subscribers on November 7th of 2023. We did 232 streams. We made 23 pr like produced videos and we did 92 shorts this year. 232 streams is a lot of streams. Uh, we're gonna move over to this window right here. And then this year, these are all of the shorts that we did. Look at all these videos. And uh, it's just crazy to look at how much we got done in a year and how many, how many great memories of shorts we have here because I have a pretty high standard for my shorts. I don't make them unless I genuinely think they're funny or worth posting. Like if I were to go up to somebody and show them, hey, look at this video, or if somebody were to do that to me, would I genuinely be interested in watching what they show me? Um, it, which is kind of hard to do because anytime you're not in a video, it's not as interesting. So I don't just make a short and be like, oh, I made a short just to upload. I really do try and make them worth watching every time. Like I said, we did 92 shorts for this year. So uh, that's quite a few. 
and uh i mean i recorded all this edited this uploaded this titled this tagged this like it it's a decent amount of work so i'm pretty proud of this body of work right here but that right there is just the shorts we did for 2023 and then i also have some thumbnails opened up here because i wanted to recap some things about thumbnails last year's anniversary video i talked about uh different thumbnails and uh how happy i was with the progression from the starting thumbnail to where we are now and this year i feel like my thumbnails are even better even though i only did 20 i think i only made 23 thumbnails this year which like i said is way less than what i normally do i feel like the quality of the thumbnail is just so much better uh and so this one is one of my favorite thumbnails for the year i feel like the editing i did on this neck and just like the shading and stuff makes it look like a really good thumbnail it's a very clean edit so i really like this thumbnail just wanted to show it just because i was proud of this one and then I wanted to show this thumbnail because this was the first thumbnail that I figured out how to do this glow effect. And I had been wanting to do these in videos for a long time. It's hard to sit down and take the time to learn a new skill. I usually just am wanting to crank out a thumbnail, but I took the time to learn how to do this. And um, now I know how to do it uh, pretty quickly. And I just love the the addition that these little lights can bring to thumbnails. This is also the first thumbnail I think that I ever did color correction on. The boss's old Mac or whatever this guy is from Pit was really dark and hard to see. So I did some color correction on this photo to really bring out the image so that you could see what was happening better. And so I wanted to show this thumbnail as a sign of progression through the year as well, that this glow is here. And I did my first ever color correction. And this is one of my thumb favorite thumbnails from the whole year. It's the, Modern Warfare 2 FAL nuke video. And I have the two main maps that are featured in the video as the background. And then I did this cut right down the edge here and put that green line in there to just kind of highlight. And again, I use that glow effect right here to use the FA, have the FAL have this cool glow to make the thumbnail pop a little more. And then I used the trimming technique, which I have known how to do for more than a year now, but to get my cut out right here and this is actually uh taken out of the video this isn't i didn't pose for this to put it in a video i actually just took that image of me out of this video put it up uh and modern warfare 2 is like my favorite game of all time and so that also makes this a uh, thumbnail that i really like but uh yeah this one i feel like uh if you had shown this to me six years ago i'd be mind blown that i would know how to do this eventually so just another sign of progression that I enjoyed from this year. And then this one again shows that I learned how to do the color hues. And so I again had to turn this image, cut this image out, throw it over a layer, and then do the shading and the color adding. My logo is the new additions to thumbnails. I didn't used to have that in my thumbnails. And then I also Photoshopped this Merry Christmas image and noticed that my finger is over the image so i had to add multiple layers to make that work and so this thumbnail i also thought was a pretty good sign of my progression and uh learning how to edit thumbnails so i want to throw this one in here and then this thumbnail is cool because i did some shading i did this custom background on my own where it's red and fades to black i had never done that before um which isn't really honestly that crazy but i wanted to include it because this is my favorite video of the year i i uploaded it right at the very end of the year it just came out earlier this week but uh, i wanted to throw this one out there just to uh show what my favorite video was for the year and now i'd like to roll into the thank yous and first and foremost uh, beastly takes it again beastly is just killing it he's always in like every stream he pops he pops in the chat almost immediately every stream and says what's up guys how are you so beastly we appreciate the heck out of you man you rock uh, and this year, Beastly bought me a battle pass and skins in Fortnite. He went all out. OG pass unlocked. What does that mean? How's that possible? How is this one lost? I appreciate you guys. Beastly, thank you so much for buying me the Fortnite OG battle pass. I appreciate you, dude. Beastly, the homie. So Beastly is without a doubt the MVP of the viewership of the AK Border 22 gaming channel. So Beastly, thanks, man. You rock. Love having you in the chat and love playing the games with you. Get that dang headset, boy, so you can freaking play and chat with us. Beastly's been headsetless for a while. Uh, Warlock on the list again. Uh, Warlock obviously plays Destiny with us and hangs out in Destiny streams. He was there for the blind dungeon again for Warlord's Ruin, which was mega hype. Was glad he made it, Warlock. 
love having you in the chat love playing games with you as well this year we're going to add send skull to the list send skull has been hopping in the streams for the modern warfare 2 streams and the destiny streams has been hanging out so send skull thanks for being there man uh this year we're going to throw matt in there everything was taken or ritmo taken now we're gonna throw him into the list uh, he played a lot of destiny with us this year and was also uh i think the last two if not three i can't remember what the last dungeon was before ghost of the deep but matt was in the blind dungeon runs with us so matt thank you for being there to play destiny with us always have a good time he's a great sport i'm always trolling him throwing him off ledges with swords and whatnot and uh, i love playing with matt matt thank you for playing games and being there with us for those uh and then seth of course seth uh as much as he is a troll he is in the comments of pretty much every video i think seth is the the number one commenter on all my videos which i really do like to see what he had to say and catch up on those comments so seth thank you for the youtube comments and of course all the gaming we do as well lots of fortnite played uh this year especially with fortnite og and uh it's been good to play games with seth and read comments that he's thrown out there and then will of course the freaking duo to the channel uh the channel would for sure not exist without will will gave me the first elgato to record the first videos i ever did and um and i can't i can't game by myself anytime i game solo i get bored so quick and will as without a doubt who i play with the most he's on at the same times that i'm on and we play games and just have the best time <laughs> <laughs> so funny. <laughs> so Will, thanks for being an absolute bro and playing games with me. Even though uh most of the time you let me pick what game we play and deal with me when I throw temper tantrums and you're the best. Thanks, man. You freaking rock. Uh and then last but not least, the wife. Uh Sarah, thank you so much for letting me have this entire room to dedicate to my hobby of gaming and uh, making YouTube videos and uh, allowing me to decompress by playing games and uh, giving me the time that it takes to make videos and holding down the fort and doing everything that you do for me and for our family. So I thank you so much for that. Uh, words cannot express how grateful I am for everything that you do for us. Love you, hon. So that's going to do it for our six year anniversary video. And I know I listed a handful of people by name, but actually everyone. Thank you so much who is in the live stream chat, who's in the video comments, uh, commenting on shorts, whatever. Thank you so much for interacting with the channel. It does make it a lot more fun. And uh, let's move on into 2024 for year seven. And I'll see you guys later on the channel.